everybody so this video is kind of going to be a different type of review so if all you're interested in is beauty things then you probably won't be interested in this video but this video is going to be all about customizable chocolate and I discovered this company through LaPook or Danielle here on YouTube and this company is called Chocomize and I just got the package today like I literally just got back from the post office or from my mailbox and got this package and basically Chocomize is a website that was started by three men who met at Columbia University and they decided that they wanted to get into the world of customizable products and they through a shared interest in chocolate they decided that that was going to be the route so you go on this website and the first thing that you do um, is pick your base chocolates. You can pick between milk chocolate, white chocolate, and dark chocolate. And you pick your base chocolate and then you can add all sorts of toppings. You can add up to five different toppings per chocolate bar and the combinations are endless. They have some pre-made combinations up there that have been bestsellers so you can get um, some of their most popular combinations. They also have one that's called the I Feel Lucky Bar which I'll tell, talk to you about that in a minute. But their combinations are endless. They have everything from the normal things like um, different types of chocolate, different types of peanut butter that you can put on top, coconut, they have all different types of fruits, and they even have um, some of your, I guess, less usual things such as bacon, they have salt, they have chipotle, uh, mini chipotle um, peppers you can put on, they have um, lavender, the choices they have are endless, so it really is 100% um, customizable, you can put up to five um, different things on there. The website's amazing. I'll definitely link their website in the description bar But the first thing I noticed when I got this package was this and this is basically like a mini cooler that they put it in um, And then when I open the package up, I have There's just this note that basically says that enjoy your custom chocolate and it just tells you a little bit about their team and Then in the bottom they actually had an ice pack Ugh, Hang on <laughs> There's actually an ice pack packaged in the bottom of my chocolate. Now, this is one of those, just one of those like gel ice packs. Now, by the time I got it, obviously it wasn't cold anymore, but this definitely helped keep my chocolate cold um, or, you know, cold so it didn't melt because I do live in Florida. So they do recommend on their website that you kind of keep an eye out for the tracking to try to get your package as soon as it's delivered. But if there is an issue, they say that you can email them and they'll either, either refund you your money or send you out a new bar. I didn't have any problems melting. I live in Florida, so um, I did get the package pretty soon. I think I got the package about half an hour after it was delivered, so it didn't sit there for too long. Um, the first bar that I got was this one, and this one is the I Feel Lucky bar. So this one has um, what looks like it's a white chocolate base and this is the packaging that they come in they look like this they're a pretty large bar um, this one looks like it has it's a white chocolate base and it looks like it has coconut sliced almonds and marshmallows so I was kind of hoping it might have been something kind of out of the ordinary but I mean it, the possibilities with this are endless and the I feel lucky chocolate bar cost three dollars and 95 cents which is awesome because when you make your own chocolate bar the base cost or the cost of um, just a plain chocolate bar is 3.95 so for 3.95 i got the base chocolate bar and i got the different um i got one two three different toppings in it so that's that one and then the one that i actually ordered was um it ended up costing me five dollars and 65 cents all the toppings cost a different price so you could get um, a super expensive chocolate bar you get something cheaper and I started with a dark chocolate base and I got um, mini pretzels in it which cost 75 cents and I got peanut butter drops which cost 95 cents so that's this one and um, let me see if I can open it now there was an option on the website to name your chocolate bar and I kind of thought that that would show up on the packaging but it didn't on the back it just tells you um, what's in your chocolate bar the I feel lucky one the I feel lucky bar didn't say what was in it it just says um, I feel lucky bar but this one says dark chocolate with mini pretzels and peanut butter drops and that's the one that I got and I have not tried these yet so I am going to try it right now and this is um, sorry guys, this is the packaging and it just kind of slides out of the packaging right here and it has all of the nutrition facts on the back for your individual um, For e your individual bar the I feel lucky bar doesn't have or it has nutrition facts But all of it says zero <laughs> Everything says zero so I'm guessing they just have a standard label that they use for that one But for this one um, it has the specific um, nutrition facts on the back And here is the bar. I don't know if you can see but it has the little mini squares on the back just like this and then on my bar, um, I got 
I'm a little bit, I wish they had put more pretzels on this, and I know Danielle kind of forewarned about this, that on her bar, I think on her bar she only got four pretzels. On my bar, I only got three mini pretzels, and that cost um, 75 cents for mini pretzels, so I'm not quite sure if each of these mini pretzels was worth 25 cents. Um, I feel like they could have put another mini pretzel on here, at least to give me four, but that's all right. Um, and then there's some peanut butter drops here, so I'm going to open it up, and... I'm going to just take a bite and see how it tastes. <laughs> so the quality of this dark chocolate is really amazing. Um, a lot of times I find with dark chocolate is that they use, it's a lower percentage of cocoa, so it doesn't have that nice kind of bitter zing that dark chocolate has, but this is really good. This bar is super fantastic. Um, one other thing that I forgot to mention was that I spent $6.95 on shipping. I think Danielle said that their shipping costs more in the summer. Um, because they add the ice packs and they add all the extra things to make it um, last through the summer heat during shipping. So I'm not sure what shipping costs the rest of the year, if it's always $6.95, but my order came out to um, $14.07. I also had a coupon code, so I got $2.48 off my order, and my total was $14.07. So I think that was pretty good. I'm definitely going to be ordering from them again. If you've had an experience with them, let me know, or if you have any questions or comments, as always, leave them below. Thanks, guys. Until next time, stay beautiful. Bye.